Welcome to MWE, and a big thank you to our patron supporters, Yako, Taco, and Dan. You can get your name on a chair by supporting us using the link in the description below. On his withering, little mad. You know, I'm kind of like Big Mad now because, like, I'm big. I, I'm the same size as Golden Mad. I deserve the respect, but I can't pay no announcer any money. And I just sold my gold chain. Do you see it? No. Right, do you see this? I bought a haircut. That's how it works. I don't even know. Oh, man. How do you even use real money? It's all Bitcoin, like usually. But it's dollar bill? Where is this green crop? Who's Bill? Little Mad apparently is falling upon hard times again. Ah, uh, next time WWE Champion Little Mad. So far, zero people have signed the petition. There was one. Tiny, uh, they removed their pledge, unfortunately, for this little blue specimen, or gold. He's wearing a blue shirt. A little mad. Making it rain out here. Wonder what happened to his wealth. You know, I can't afford to do a backflip because if I land on my head, I'll uh, not be able to pay the medical bill. Unfortunate yeah. times. <laughs> and his opponent, Steak Longhorn. Yo, I am Steak Longhorn. Ian, you just took a mighty beating from Owen. I'm sad to see the results, but I know that you'll make it through. You're in surgery right now, buddy, but soon you'll be back in the circle of dome trampa ring, and we'll be tussling just like the olden days. And right now, I'm setting my sights on this guy like I'm looking through a sniper scope because I'm the sharpshooter, just like the hitman, Brad Hart. Yo! And you know what happens when I win this match? I get placed into the ladder match at the final Jika in two weeks. And then I'll be able to get that chair and I'll be able to cash in whenever I want. It's true. This match is a qualifying match for the chair shot. The chair shot is a ladder match upon which a chair is hung up and it's a ladder match but you have to grab a chair and then you can cash in the chair by hitting the champion of your choosing which one of these men will be in it ring the bell ding 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 little mad wants to be the next mwe champion if he wins that chair that's a very real possibility. And he turns that around. Reverse DDT. One, two, kick out. Shout out to Sting who stole the sharpshooter. Tripping him down and now he's going for the sharpshooter. And he turns it around. He turns it around and... He gets to the ropes. One. Letting go at a one count. Brett. Brett. Bang! Brett the hit me hard! The Bret Hart fanatic. Snake Longhorn has just tossed him. One, two, kick out. Little Mad in a bad way right now. 
<laughs> horn dog. And he stabs the horn into the side. One, two, kick out. Steak Longhorn has gone a long way from being Owen in a mask. Wait, roll up one, two, one. No, they're on the rope. Wait, one, two. And he pulls through one, two, kick out. When Steak Longhorn first appeared, he had a death match with Owen, like usual. Trying to turn it into a unique submission hold. Not going for an outside dive. Spinning kick. And now, Little Mad's got him. The claw slam, and he hits it. The claw slam. Can he capitalize? Yes, one, two, kick out. He kicked out of the claw slam. The golden little claw. I'm just surprised he could lift him. Elbow drop. One, two, kick out. Little Mad now going for a submission hold of his own. The STF. No, he does not have the head. He's just pulling on the ankle. And now he's pulling on the face to complete the hold. Shout out to Jonathan C. Nation. Pulling himself to the ropes. Dragging the weight of both of them and he is so close. He is so close. Just pulling, trying to get to the ropes. He reaches them. One. Letting go. It looks like the hold was broken at the same time. It's a hard move to keep on. And a leg DDT. And a stiff shot to the midsection. Pulling him up to his feet. And Tornado DDT. One, two, kick out. The claw, the claw attached to the hand. Some would call it a lockup. A test of strength even. Oh, a lariat. A lariat with the pad off. One, two, three. Here is your winner, Steak Longhorn. Ding, ding, freak a ding, brother. We have a winner. And the first man to qualify, Steak Longhorn. Steak Longhorn has joined the ladder match. Let's see who will join him in that fight for the chair. Cash it in any time for any championship. Wow. Let's see who the next qualifying match contains. Making his way to the ring, the Luchador, the premier Luchador, Azalito. I may have came up short in recent times, but it's my time now. I'm pretty sure it was last summer when I was the Chica champion. Actually, I'm almost positive. And this summer, it's gonna be the same. I'm gonna get that chair, and I'm gonna cash it in on Ian. And become the second ever two-time Chica champion. And I'm gonna beat Ian to the three-time Chica champion. Angelito making this personal calling out Ian. He could cash in on Owen, possibly, if he won. He just wants the Chica title. Second time, he was the first ever Chica champion. Sticky! 
Azalito and his opponent. Who could it be? Oh my gosh, it's Owen, the champion! Oh, he is still banged up from that insane Extreme Rules match. If you haven't seen it, go back and check it out. Wow. I'm not 100%. He knows that. That's why he signed on for this match. This is not fair. And Ian, I'm in this match because of you. I'm in this match because I want that Chica Championship back. I won the match. So I am still MWE Champion. But I'm missing the Chica Champion. I feel like since I won, I should still have both belts, but once I grab that chair. And you right in the back. Harsh words. I do not want to be Azalito right now. You say Owen is injured. I say he's got a fire lit inside him. Ding, ding, ding. Let's get this going. They lock up. And quickly, Azalito hits a drop down DDT. And now, Pendulum Elbow. And a diving headbutt. Diving headbutt. Pounding the mat. Viper style. He wants the champ to get back up to his feet. Oh, jumping, jumping chop. And a jumping uppercut. Oh, SummerSlam, but he might have landed on the knees. Could have hurt himself a little bit. One, two, shoulder up. Maybe I spoke too soon. Owen is down and out right now as we speak. Come on. He's got it locked in across face using the arm. Owen's arms are held in. Azalito, roll up one. Only a one count. Let's see what they're going for next. Azalito hits the forearm to the back of the neck. Oh my gosh. Owen trips him through and gets right into the figure four leg lock. Figure four. His shoulders are down one, two. He needs to mind those shoulders. Because you can get pinned in a figure four. Oh, reversing the pressure, but Owen gets the ropes. One, two, three. Broken up. Smart thinking from Azalito. He truly is a long standing veteran here in MWE. He's been here for four years. Oh my gosh. MWE will have its five year anniversary next year. Think about how crazy that is. And Owen has been dominant for all of them. And the package pile driver. Shipping him off to whichever local medical facility ah. will take him and now dismantling the leg ah. 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 just straining that right leg he could be the famous one-legged luchador if this goes Owens way but Owens face just went way into the steel right here that is solid steel ankle lock ankle lock Azalito has Owen in the center of the ring. He cannot make it. He makes it to the ropes. He, no, the ropes being pulled away from the ropes by Azalito. Will he give up? He is in the center of the tramp ring. He has been in this ankle lock for far too long, but he just... Switches through into his own ankle lock. Rope break one, two. Oh my gosh. The pain 
etched across the face, across the mask even. And Owen fights strong with the right elbow strike and a trouble in paradise. Yeah, you yeah, no. Just takes him down. Wrenching the arm. Oh, an arm ringer sends the blue chador flipping and flopping and not in the way he wants to. He almost landed right on his blue dome. Oh, and a twisting forearm smash. Oh, pendulum five knuckle shuffle. An obvious jab at the Jika champion, Ian. Best wishes to Ian as he meets Dr. Surgery for the millionth time, and he's setting up for a 450. Oh, it's a prank. It's a prank. Oh my gosh, 450 headbutt. 450 headbutt, one, two, and the foot is on the ropes. 450 headbutt. So much collision there. Those masks offer no protection. And that's a fact. Extreme pain for both of them. And Owen just took a headbutt from Ian in their match just a few days ago. One, two, foot on the ropes again. Wow. What is Owen looking for now? A spinning choke slam? No. Oh my gosh, a German suplex. Late release on that. Azalito is firing back up. What is he looking for now? Suck a splash charged up and he just dives right onto the knees. Right onto the knees, he is writhing in pain. Oh my gosh. He always hits that with as much force as possible, so landing on the champ's knees, that hurts. True pain was achieved after that maneuver, and the fist to the forehead. What is Owen looking for now? He dives through the air like an eagle and with an axe handle to the head of the Bluchador. He is taken out. Azolito, his eyes are glazed over, glazed like a donut. Hurts, donut. Oh my gosh, is he looking for what he hit against Ian? The draping butterfly DDT onto the bare ground. And no, Azalito fights through. Oh, and jumping and driving the champ into the steel. Oh my gosh, a leaping sucker splash on the solid steel. Oh, but he just collapses. Azalito just collapses, not able to make that move worth every bit of pain because Owen is recharging as we speak. Just filling up his energy every second that he wastes. One, two, he wasted way too many seconds there. When you hit a finishing maneuver, you have to strike fast with a pinning cover. Or it will not be enough. But he obviously has enough left in the tank. Airplane spin. Wasteland. Airplane spin. Wasteland. And now that sucker splash to end it. He catches him. He catches him all the way up. Oh, knee to the stomach. All the way up. And now... A power bomb! One, two, three. No, 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 no. He kicked out. A Batista bomb. And think of the whiplash that Azalito probably just went through with that quick spinning sit out power bomb. 
His head might be spinning still. And now, Owen, quick stunner. This time he releases it, and did you see Azalito just go flipping and flying out of the trampa ring? I don't know if it was on purpose, but he definitely created separation. And just like I said before, there was too much time between the maneuver and a possible pinfall to win off of that move. And head first he goes into the steel. No protection as I stated before. And there's the leg drop. One, two. No strength behind that kick out. But that just shows that Owen could have won if he used a stronger cover. What is he going for now? Is this the TKO? Crucifix bomb. One, two. Oh, my gosh. That was the closest... I've ever seen Owen to losing in a long time. Check knife cover one, two, three. Ding, 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 ding. The winner of this match and qualified for the suspended chair match. The MWE Unified Champion. Owen. Wow. He went into this not 100% but he used wrestling maneuvers to beat Azalito and qualify against the fresh man. He wants that chair badly, and he might just get it in two weeks on Jacob.